looking at? Um, you're looking at the old town of Dubrovnik in Croatia, and this was actually taken uh, right before the war, so uh, the rooftops look much different today than they did in this photo. It actually looks like a painting. It does, and I waited about 15 years to actually um, have this photo blown up this large and framed. And um, once again, the Phoenix Gallery did an, just an amazing job with this photo. Uh, I couldn't be more pleased. Uh, the, the tonal aspects of the photo uh, are perfect in the mats that he selected. Um, and it, the frame is rustic, and it's just beautifully done. And this is a companion piece right here. They're framed identically? They are framed identically. That's a nice um, touch. They are of the same area. Um, they're both inside the old town. And again, the map selection and the fillets that are done uh, to complement the, the piece of art itself and the rustic nature of this frame, that couldn't have been done more perfectly. Well, this is a beautiful piece and you've actually allowed us to feature her on the Phoenix Gallery homepage. Who is the artist? The artist is Karen Volker. She's a German artist. And uh, I was in Carmel and saw her and fell in love with her and uh, scooped her right up. And she was unframed in my previous home for a while. And when I moved, Michael absolutely correctly convinced me uh, that she needed a frame. And uh, he took her away to the Phoenix Gallery and brought her back in this magnificent frame. Well, this is a beautiful set. It is. Once again, Michael has a wonderful eye and always knows where there's a wall that um, requires some artwork. Here's another sequence that is, is beautiful. He, these prints were actually bought in Kona, in the Kona Antique Store. Uh, yes. Filet details, very beautiful. I love this molding. They do have an amazing assortment. They pick what is going to enhance the artwork itself without um, taking away from the beauty of that. It's just a beautiful enhancement. Um, and look how gorgeous it looks on this wall. And the installation he does is they're always really well done. Um, these were my grandmother's cards and they were on her kitchen table every time that I was there. We tried to give her new cards and she washed these and taped them. And, and so um, it's the one, one really important thing that I have of hers. And, he did a beautiful shadow box. And there's some, did. these are tarot cards. This is beautifully done. Very intricate and beautifully done. And they just really, as I say, enhance the beauty of the art itself without, you know, creating a distraction to it. It just makes the piece just that much more beautiful. This is fun. These are quite see the glare. These are cards coming out of a top hat like a magician. What's the story about this? Well, it's obviously an old piece and uh, Michael Cuisson, the owner of um, the Phoenix Gallery, is very creative and because I had uh, other card items in here, found this piece and um, very uh, sim simply but very lovely frame this for me to um, continue the theme. In this These are beautiful. These cool. are Butterflies? They prints. are butterflies and they're, um, they're old illustrations and you can find you know, butterflies, shells, botanicals, they are all available um, for purchase uh, at the Phoenix Gallery. Besides being a great framer, um, Michael's also an artist in his own right. Now um, these are two that he gave to you? Yes. And they can actually create these works of art for your decor. Um, and then frame them better than anybody, really. Better than anybody. One of the things you do is, is the fillet. Mm -hmm. We use a lot of them. And so just that just offset, help offset the, the mats? It offsets, it separates the color from color, and it also provides some depth to the image. We've pulled out two moldings that I think will work. Um, we want to pull out the black and we want to pull out gold. And looking like that one's the better option for this case. 